From beautiful South Florida, there's a look at Hard Rock Stadium in Miami. Tonight, we've got a great Sunday night matchup on tap, as it'll be the Armadillos of Toronto taking on the Miami Dolphins. The shadow's starting to get a bit longer. Week 10 of the NFL season is here, and we're underway on EA Sports. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Now problems right out of the gate. We're going to get a delay. They'll look to throw now on first down. The catch made by DeAndre Hopkins. And they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. Just like that, a pickup of 20 on their first play from scrimmage. Certainly no settling into the drive there. They came right out on the first play and attacked the middle of the field for a big gainer and a first down. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Going right back to DeAndre Hopkins. And they'll get to him after a gain of seven to the 47. So we just called his name on the previous snap, and they go right back to him, Charles, for a second consecutive completion. Yeah, I think what we're discovering on this drive is that he feels like he has answers no matter what defense you throw up there. He reads it, finds the open spot, and is available for the completion. Go, Reeves, go! First run of the game here for Damian Pierce. Seven yards there and a first down. We use the word relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. In this case, it really fits, doesn't it? How about his ability to break tackles and his feet never stop moving? Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Pierce. A good pick up there of 20 yards. It's a gain of 20. First down, Armadillo. First and ten, it's Pierce. And not able to break away this time as they're going to stop him right around the line of scrimmage. Call it no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. This defense for the Dolphins, they were excellent a week ago in that victory over Indianapolis. And I'm eager to see the game plan and try to attack them this week because when you take it away four times through interceptions, what do you do now when you go into a game? Do you decide you can't throw the ball? Do you try and run it more? And it's caught. Touchdown. A great effort there with his 16th touchdown of the year. And the Armadillos will claim the early lead as they're on the board first here tonight. One of the keys to their long winning streak has been scoring first. An ideal drive right there, getting the first six points of the ball game. Do you go back to our meeting with the offensive coordinator? Remember oh, yeah. what he told us? Absolutely. With some teams, I script to probe in the early part of the game. Other teams, I script to attack. They've been in attack mode for these ball games and continue that in this one. 
Hill is going to take it out of the end zone. And he's going to be out of bounds here as the run back will leave him shy of the 20-yard line. Throwing on first down is Mahomes. Swinging this out wide here for Cook. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. Counting down toward the midway point in quarter one. On first and ten, here's Mahomes. Give him a couple on the scramble in second down. Here's Mahomes to throw. Steps away. Mahomes hit. He lost the football. And it looks like one of the DBs has it. And his guys are going to take over at the 34-yard line. And now, meanwhile, after the dust settles on the fumble, we've got an injured player here as well. We'll get an update when we come back to Miami. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Pierce takes it straight ahead. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. You talk about this Miami defense. They come into this one ranked number 17. So just starting the bottom half of the league against the Pats. And when you're getting ready to face the number one overall offense in the NFL, it does not matter where you rank defensively because you got your hands full. You don't know what you're going to face, but you know that that's a strong unit that you're getting ready for. Well, that'll be incomplete with the penalty marker down as well. And I think he was beyond the line of scrimmage when that ball left his hand. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. Able to find the open man. Complete. And they move this all the way down to the nine. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Touchdown, turnover, touchdown, and quickly trying to make it 14 to nothing. Yeah, and mentioned it already. On the road, to be able to go into someone else's house and establish a start like that, obviously your confidence rises in a big way, and you're putting some doubt in their minds. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. Hill is going to take it out of the end zone. And the decision to bring it out, not a good one, as he's tackled at the 15. At their own 15-yard line. First down Miami as they get set to start the drive. And they come into this one riding that nice long win streak. And remember, next weekend is an open week for them. So if they can get the win here, a lot of momentum into that time off. It certainly is. And if you're wondering if anybody's saying, boy, this is coming at a bad time, we want to keep playing. The answer can be yes, because when teams are on a hot streak, they want to keep going. But when the veterans are telling the young guys in the locker room, an open week is always good, guys. Take it, and let's go with it. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And this pass broken up. 
Uh, the contact well timed there, and now fourth down. Here's Tressway now, as his first punt will come from inside his own end zone. That's going to go in the books as a 55-yard punt. Well done. And they will take over first and 10. The offense back out there at the line, ready for their next drive. And there, of course, was a lot of talk about this ball game coming into play. Two division leaders. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. And a return across midfield into the 46-yard line. Intercepted. The Dolphins take over first and 10 at the 46-yard line. Now after the INT, it's Carr. It's Hill, complete. And he'll be taken down as that will take us to the end of the first quarter of play. 14-0 the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. Four now. Here's first and ten. Yo, Chief. Your mic. From the gun, it's Carr. Incomplete. The Dolphins at eight and one on the year. They've been playing their best football of the year. Winners are four in a row. And I thought that they played pretty well last week. Their execution, their discipline, their resilience, all on display in that victory. Ninety-three. Here's Carr to throw. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. And did he get the feet down? Yes, touchdown. Deontay Johnson, 34 yards. And the Dolphins have cut it back within a score. themselves and he'll elect not to return this one so they'll bring it out to the 25 on the touchback the offense now at the line ready for their next drive and for this offense, Charles, you got to think kind of crucial here to put something together on this drive because remember last time out, they threw the interception on the very first play. And you can't afford to let this defense keep building any more momentum. They're playing awfully well, and they're awfully confident right now. To me, it's time to attack and take some of that momentum back. But make sure you're selective in doing so. Understand where you want to throw the football and make sure it's open before the ball leaves your hands. Here's a throw to his running back. It's complete. And he gets us to the other side of midfield across the 45 before going out. A good gain again. That's now 31 yards combined on those last two plays. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. They'll find Schwartz complete right side. They'll wind up getting seven on the play. And that's going to bring up second down. Brings up second and three. The 37 yard line. Okay, ready. Off the RPO, he completes it. 
Down the left sideline. Touchdown! A great play there. Two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Armadillos have taken a two-touchdown lead now.